Hey guys, JCTOSU here, and I'm doing a uh, video on, I mean, this is a tech it, but it's more on the computer craft mod. I just kind of wanted to show you a little bit. Um, I might have a video that shows how to download this mod, but this mod is insane, uh, but it, I'm not really here to show it off. I just want to show you guys some uh, different stuff that you can do with it. The most thing that we're looking at right here today is um, working with redstone. So basically what we'll want to do is we'll place a computer right here and we'll put some redstone going like this so you guys can see. So basically when you get into the computer, it looks like this. So basically when you type something like hello, it says, oh hello, okay, okay, that's not what I meant to do. Let's say hey. So hey, you door knob fail um so um door knob okay <laughs> um off track okay. off track um so hello actually gives you hello world i forgot that it does that but if you want to edit it if you go to edit hello and it has nothing okay bad example bad example everybody okay so basically when you type something like like um boom let me okay phone okay why is it doing this to me okay let's do form form see so there's nothing that or let's do creeper 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 there we go good spell okay so creeper gives or zombie there that's what i want to do so it says no such program so you're like well what the heck so basically what you want to do is you want to hit edit zombie so now you're into this so now what you want to do is if you want it to print something when you type that you do this and then what do you want it to print let's say uh zombie will spawn in one second so yep so that's what it will say so let's just save it uh, save okay so now with that we type zombie zombie a zombie will spawn in one minute so that works so edit zombie so basically that's the first code we got so next we want to you know work with the redstone so basically what you want to type is redstone dot set output parentheses quotation mark and then which way you want it to be you can go back left right so basically uh where's our redstone going we're going right so we want to go like that but we don't want to put a parenthesis around that you don't want to do that what you want to do is you want to do a comma and then you want to do true so that will set the redstone to the right of the computer true so basically after you got that all right let's so you guys can kind of see it um No, this will work. Okay. Let's okay. Let's save this. So now our redstone is not um is not let so let's uh one second. Let me turn this. Okay. So now it's dark. Now you can see if the redstone actually lights up. So basically, you'll type in zombie, and then it'll light up. See, but it'll light up forever. So you have to re or re reboot there we go that's what i was going to do so now it's not there anymore so basically now what we want to do is we want to go back into edit zombie so now we got this code so now we what we want to do is say we want to i don't know um make it um well maybe we want to set up a dispenser and you know make a zombie spawn. So basically dot set output. So you do the exact same thing except you do the exact same thing and then comma and you want to change this to false. So then it'll turn it off but you might want to make it sleep for one second. That's what I would do. About one second. So it gives it time to actually 
make the zombie come out. So then, what you want to do for most of your creations is so it doesn't keep doing this, is you want to do slash OS, OS shutdown parentheses, like that. So basically, now we have this thing going. And so, yep, let's test this out. So basically, we'll put a dispenser here. And then we'll put the zombie egg right there. And then we'll type in slash zombie, or zombie. And it spawns a zombie. And then it'll wait. Or wait. Didn't we have it? Um. But it did it, so. Uh, let me see. Uh, Oh, it didn't save? That's weird. Um So let me type this in real quick. Uh so yeah, that was really unexpected right there. Um Okay. Uh Okay, so Basically, now we got this code, um, so, yeah, so now we'll put another zombie in, and so how you save it is you go control, and then you hit S, and then you want to hit control again, and then E, and then you want to hit reboot, so then I'll say goodbye, blah, 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 craft OS, okay, so let's put another zombie, zombie egg, in there, okay, so let's try this again. So now we do zombie, it'll spawn, and then it'll shut it off. Look at that. So that's basically how you do that. You can do it with anything that requires redstone, and so yeah. Um. So let's delete this redstone. So basically, okay, so let's see. This will actually work on doors, too. Say we have a door there. Now, zombie is in my way. Okay. So basically, now that we got the door there. We actually have the same code for that because the door, you know, is redstone. So, basically, when you sleep it, that's how long the redstone will actually be true. So, basically, what you want to change the sleep to is how many seconds you want the door to stay open. Usually, I do two. That should be enough. And then, this is basically all correct, unless if you want to change this. Um, door. Door will... Open. This is also to create passwords too, so you can just change it there. Uh, save that, and now when you reboot it, say goodbye. Now when you do zombie, the door will open, and then it will shut. But um, if you want like to make it a password kind of thing, you can do um, edit, start up. So this is what happens when you start it up. So the computer. So basically, you could say print, uh, enter, oops, enter password. Okay, so now that we got that, we hit save and then enter. Okay, so now we, oh, goodbye, enter password, look at that. So now if we do zombie, the door will open, we go through, the door will shut for us. And we could do that anyways. And then see how it says enter password, because if we didn't have that, Oh, it's shut down, then it wouldn't, like, it would just show enter password, then what I would type, enter password, what I would type. So it would just keep going long. So let me type zombie again. Door will open, I will go through, and then that's it. So, uh, guys, thanks for watching, and uh, make sure to subscribe. And check out the mod, it's, it's called Computercraft. And so, um, yeah, thanks for watching, and uh, see you guys later. Make sure to sub. And like is always appreciatable. And um, so, yeah. Um, see you guys later. Bye.